Hello. In this video, we will take a look at short questions that can be asked on functions. First very popular question is, what is void return type? Void is a keyword used in Java to indicate that a method does not have any return value. Next question could be, do we need to write return in method body which has a return type of void? The answer is no. The return is optional in such case. Another question could be, can we call return from the middle start of method body or can a method have multiple return statements? Answer is yes. A program can have multiple return statements, but only one first encountered will be executed. Other kind of questions is where you are asked to write a method prototype. For example, write a function find which receives a sentence and a word and returns 1 or 0. Here you have to correctly identify the data types based upon the information given. Like both sentence and word are string data types in Java and 1 and 0 both can be captured as data type int. The second question could be write a method is correct which receives a character and an integer and returns true or false. Here you will use boolean as return type and char and int as the parameters. Here stick to only answering the question which is asked and do not try to add in your own class or access specifier etc. Other kind of question could be where you are given a sample code and you are asked to correct it. Take a look at this sample. Here we first see the method and we see that variable name has brackets which needs to be removed. Second, the method returns a value which has not been done. Next, if we see the main, the method has been used without passing the parameter which needs to be corrected. Do note, in all the questions, expectation is not to do a rewrite or major modification. These are mostly short 1 to 2 mark questions, so stick to correcting only the part of the code given. Let's take a look at this another example. Here if we first see the method give number, it has missing formal parameters which also needs to be used for assignment to num. In main method, the object that needs to be instantiated is number. Then you can use obj to refer to give number function and num variable. Another type of question is where you are given a program and you are asked your understanding of it. Let's see this small program sample. First question is what is reference data type and what is primitive data type used in this code? Answer is int and number. Int is used for return type as well. What member variable is used here and what is the expected data type of it? The member variable which is used over here is value of object num. Since this is getting returned as int, its data type is int. Let's look at another example. In this code, identify which one is local, instance and class variable. Here the variable which is used inside the method is the local variable. The variable which is outside of method in the class and have separate copy for each instance of the class are called as instance variable. Variables which are declared static and have a single copy irrespective of number of instances of class then it is called class variable. 